I'm here at Arden Studios in Memphis, Tennessee, recording my new album, The Golden Hour. I'm working with Adam Hill, who's an incredible engineer who worked on uh, Big Star Recordings. He's extremely knowledgeable and very good at what he does and very musical because he's a musician himself. Arden Studios is one of the greatest studios in the world. Um, so much amazing music has been made here that has influenced me, um, especially the music of a band called Big Star. Big Star were considered the, uh, one of the Beatles of the 70s in America, and Ardent is considered one of the Abbey Roads of America. I'm taken back in time to the 70s where uh, big studios was the norm, and uh, it's great to work in a room with so much space and so much vibe. Um, you could kind of close your eyes and imagine that you're in a session for Big Star 3rd or Radio City and just imagine you're here and during that chaotic, priceless time. Unlike a lot of other studios, they have kept most of the equipment that they used that made the sound famous. Uh, everything from the uh, mixer channels where Led Zeppelin 3 was mixed through to a lot of the equipment that Big Star used, including their high watt amplifier, their original Mellotron. So this is the Mellotron, and it's uh, a very unique instrument. Each key is a separate eight second tape loop. When you lift the key, the loop goes back. This actual Mellotron was the first one in the States. And there's this pitch knob and you can do stuff like this. Which is really unique. Go to the ending section after the let's take it from the from right before the ending section where there's a little bit of a build up. It's gonna be the only time I see you again. Close my eyes, drift away. Eight seconds. So this is uh, one of the holy grails, the Fardent. And Chris Bell was in Big Star, passed away, and uh, his soul is inside this thing. It's an old ES-330 that's got so much uh, vibe and so much mojo. And it's just, uh, it's one of the, one of my favorite things in the world. And it's just magic. Ardent is magical, um, and I'm trying to harness a little piece of that magic with my own music. My own personal journey as a singer-songwriter has been very chaotic over the years. My journey's led me here to where a lot of the music that inspires me was made. I don't really have a set songwriting process. Some songs take 10 minutes, some songs take 10 years. I um, usually come up with a guitar progression, you know. And then I fit in the words. I should get some sleep. The dream. Working here puts me in a certain mindset to really put my best into the performances and I feel like these are some of the best performances of my life. The experience of working in a studio like this really brings out a certain element in people like me. I love creating music. There's something about getting in a room like this and performing. People forget the performance aspect of a record. You know, you hear a record, and these days especially, it's very pasteurized, and 
over-processed and auto-tuned and you don't really, you, you, a lot of records these days you can't close your eyes and imagine a band playing. I feel like studios like this are, are designed for people like me. There's soul in this room. You can't, you can't buy that, you know, this is something that was made. Yes! Uh -huh.